So I would think uh, you know uh, the steps that every investor should follow is definitely take uh, printouts of annual reports for last last four, five, uh, six years. You know you have to read through those annual reports. You read through the financial statements in those annual reports. Also critical is you read the chairman's uh, report. You read the managing director's report in that uh, re- uh, annual report. So once you have done a study of those annual reports, you know more, more or less how the company is performing over last five to ten years. So that would help you learn more about the business. Like in case if you don't know about the business that you want to invest in, then that's the good place to start with. Yeah, Puro. What I think is, you know, all businesses uh, require cash flow to sustain themselves. So the annual report will say how good is the profitability. Because if you don't have strong profitability, where will you generate the cash to reinvest into new technology, into new manpower, in new plant and machinery, into advertisement? So, so the key to my mind is uh, is checking whether the company is generating enough cash flow or enough free cash, and and then trying to apply that mind whether this cash is uh, deployed by the management in the most uh, economical manner. Or whether ROI of the cash deployment is uh, is is good, and then I also look at uh, you know regularly their presentations and uh, which they make to analysts etc. So they then many times they would say new products that they are introducing, new marketing material that they may have. So so then it is only a regular follow up and checking whether the company is going in the right direction or not.